Hi, I'm Madeline. Welcome to Contemporary Tarot. In this session, we're going to be looking at the Queen of Cups. The Queen of Cups represents a person directing all of their energies and a vision into creating something that they believe in. Uh, it could be pouring your energies into a relationship or a creative project, but really just um, being flowing and open and, and quite visionary. It can represent someone who has a great intuition, possibly psychic, or just being able to really tap into the emotions and feelings of the people around them and a deep understanding of their own emotional uh, condition and situation. Good with others, extremely honest, but also extremely kind. This represents someone who is very grounded when it comes to emotional issues and also someone who can handle complex emotional relationships or complex creative projects with great um, ease and ability. The Queen of Cups best course of action. Love yourself and others with openness and trust. Uh, believe in what you're creating, uh, focus your energies into uh, your passions, uh, flow, just let it go, dive in, commit, trust, be confident in your ability to express your feelings, listen and empathize with others, connect with other people, lead by example, focus your dreams and desires, meshing them with your goals and aspirations lead by example. Recognize what and who gives you emotional satisfaction. All right, the Queen of Cups reversed. This can represent just being hurt, um, feeling di disappointed in love or disappointed in creative projects, feeling blocked creatively, feeling blocked emotionally. Uh, this can uh, indicate some, some disappointment and frustrations, feelings of loss, feelings of sadness, grief, possibly depression, uh, being unable to tap into your feelings. It can represent someone in your life who's being dishonest or you are possibly being dishonest. This can represent feeling emotionally overwhelmed or the opposite of just even completely shutting off emotions. Uh, and this can represent either you or another being uh, perhaps a little bit manipulative. The Queen of Cups reverse, best course of action. Do not let your emotions run away from you. Uh, you might need to hide your feelings in order to remain safe. You might have to squash or stop a project uh, for the time being, it might not be the time to, uh, to show your hand, to open up to others. If you have experienced a hurt, feel it so you can then begin to move on. Don't shut it off. There might be someone in your life who is untrustworthy, dishonest, or emotionally manipulative, or someone that just might be sad. This might be a call to step away from an emotionally charged situation or relationship. Do not attempt to control others or their experience. Uh, also, ignore any whining. Um, you might have to keep a lid on your feelings. And generally, it just might not be safe to share your feelings at this time. Um, so it, it calls definitely for a, a uh, editing and um, a time to be a little bit cautious. Take care. So that's the Queen of Cups. Thanks for visiting Contemporary Tarot. I invite you to visit my website and uh, subscribe. Thank you so much. I'll see you soon.